Welcome back to KiwiTech and today we're looking at what products make our Galaxy S4 a wireless charging device. So let's have a look. Right, so this morning in the mail arrived the little pad or the adapter, I guess you should probably say, that fits in the back of your device and makes it wireless charging. This is a Metron, and there's many different devices that you can buy that do this, but you just need to make sure that it's Q enabled, and that's just the, the format of wireless charging that this Galaxy S4 accepts. So it must have QI on it somewhere, otherwise it will not work with your Galaxy S4. Uh, this one was purchased from eBay, came from uh, Korea, I think, and was only about $29, so reasonably cheap. And we got our little warranty, which looks to be in Mandarin or Cantonese, perhaps. So on the back we have 3M adhesive, and on the top we have the connectors that connect to our device. Right, so let's go and get the device and see how well it fits on. So we can see on the top we have two little holes where our connectors fit nice and tight and the 3 m adhesive will attach to the battery which is to hold it firmly in place. So let me just apply that now. Okay, so let me just peel off the back, apply the connectors to make sure it fits properly before I stick the adhesive on. Right, I'll just hold it down with my finger and there we go. Fire it up and push it on firmly. So that's all there is to it. And I'll take the battery off once I've applied it and show you that every time we remove the battery to either put the SD card in or your SIM card, you can just apply it again very easily. Right, now I'm going to put the cover back on my Neo Hybrid and the feel is slightly raised at the back. It doesn't push it out too much, but you can see if I put it on the ground, it's no longer flat like it was before. It's got a little bit of movement. Now, this is, it does look exaggerated in this clip that I'm showing you now, but it isn't actually that much. You can feel a slight bulge, but I don't think it'll be a problem, especially if you're not using a case. But I can certainly feel where the microwave strip is. Right, so I'll just now grab the wireless charging pad. It's got a little clear light in the bottom that glows blue to show it's plugged in. And now I'll reapply the battery and put the back back on the device. Okay, now it actually fits reasonably well. If you weren't using the case, you probably wouldn't even feel that it was any different. Okay, so let me power it back up and see how well it actually works, and hopefully it does work. Right, so phone's pretty much booted up. That should be very shortly. Okay, so let me let's put it on the pad and see if it actually charges. Okay, now I've muted it, obviously, because it's got distortion, and oh, you can see the warning sign comes up saying microwave charging's been enabled and the little blue light that looks kind of purple down the bottom there. So yeah, that, that works really well. Right, so I have just reapplied the Neo Hybrid case to my Galaxy S4, and I want to see if that works through the case, because it's got a little bit of thickness involved. And yep, the blue light shines up, and the warning signal appears. Right, well that's it for me today, so I hope the video has helped you Decide if you want to invest in those two products and what products you need to buy. This is KiwiTech. Thanks for watching.